I'm reading Neil de Carañoja Alvarez, and we are at the Weaving Center in Chinchero. Today is Saturday, a special day for the children. That's why today you can see many children, because uh, they come to learn and to teach each other to produce their textiles and like that. So. I'm Wake, and here with Kinlan. My wife and uh, we're so honored to be here once again in Chinchero with you, Nilda. Uh, this is really the place of uh, the core experience of the, the modern textile revival in the Andes. Uh, you've done so much work, uh, not only to preserve the patterns and to bring back the natural dyes, but to really honor the people. Uh, of the Andes and the communities of bringing back the sense of uh, community uh, artistry and uh, bringing it back through the beautiful fabrics of this land. Uh, it's just such a delight to come here with a group of people and to see their joy in, uh, in the work that the weavers have presented and uh, they're all coming away with baskets full of, of textiles that they, they want for themselves and to share with people back uh, in their home. And uh, you've done such a beautiful job to make these textiles available for people and the artistry to be rediscovered and shown and accessible uh, to people in a whole new way. It's so fun to be back here and to visit you again. We've, we've gotten to be with Nelda here in Chinchero and some of the other villages um, over the past many years. So we've had lovely experiences together. For me, it's just been very, very important, the, the heart that you bring, the, that you know the traditions of this land and so that you can help to honor them and, and help preserve them and maintain them. Uh, so it's been things like that that we've learned that, that have really helped us um, you know, stay connected from the heart with, uh, with Nelda herself and with the communities and with the project of, wow, can we keep, can we support as a, as a global society, can we support this kind of artistry so that these villages, the people in these villages can stay in their beautiful, you know, s sky open um, places and and these we textiles they bring in enough funds to the communities that it actually supports in a lot of ways supports the whole communities to be able to stay in their native lands so all of those pieces together just uh, make it just such a, a wonderful uh, place to support It's been such a delight to come back on several occasions to see you, Nilda, to see the weavers who I recognize. I have some of the pieces in my home. Friends and colleagues have uh, purchased these pieces. And uh, your influence has really spread so far. Uh, the work that you've done. Um, how did, did you ever know that you would have this kind of impact when you began? Um, no, I never, uh, at the beginning it was the dream of we brought back the textile and then the passion to organize women and to give opportunity to that woman. That's the, another dream I have. And then the next dream was to have an infrastructure where they can gather together and work hopefully comfortable. <laughs> so that's that. Um, Finally, the dream is, you know, they, to have the proud as an artist, as a weaver, to come out with the, uh, our old technique, bring back with the source and um, also the finest pieces to show that how much skill that the woman has and that you have just a dick, you have just give an opportunity for them and the opportunity where you can healing gave to this woman and they know very well that they are not just a normal visitors that they come here for one second. Their connection is much more deeper than that. And Nelda, you've, you've been the portal. You've, you've been the way in to the weaving community and to really understanding the survival of the Andean communities, how the weaving has brought back 
uh, an abundance and self-respect in the communities themselves. And finally, I simply want to say the idea about having something handmade, having um, natural dyes from uh, the plants and insects and roots of this land itself, um, in this culture of technology and, and greater separation from the land, what you've done here to bring back the land, to bring back the people, to bring back the plants and the essence of this land has been remarkable. And I, and I feel that people appreciate this so much in meeting the weavers and seeing in the, them in their process and how much loving attention goes into each piece of work. It's just so amazing to come here in your community and to share these few moments together. You've spread the message of the community and the beauty of the Andes and the Andean people to all the corners of the earth. And I wish you all the greatest amount of energy flowing forward that you can continue doing your work. And you know that we support you. And we know that everyone who's here, who's so taken by this environment and by the story of the weavings and the story of the weavers themselves and the families and the communities, this has a life of its own. And you have been the great mother to birth it. I thank you so much. Thank you, Keely. And thank you. It's wonderful. Thank you. Wonderful. Thank you.